So what I realized in 2009, as I was talking to different manufacturers when, when the market was hurting, there still was issues on the horizon for companies besides manufacturing, besides real estate. And I learned pretty quickly within the next 12 months, I decided that I needed to be more of a resource to help them or help whoever I'm working with on taking it potentially to the next level than just being one of the average 12 other real estate brokers that we're going to call a business owner and say, I want to work with you. In this business, they want you to make as many calls as possible, as fast as possible, talk to every single business owner, and they want you to find out every single need of every person. So that's, your whole business is based on a pure cold call. You really don't have any additional value add. All you're doing is just trying to get the person on the phone to see if you can help them or not. As you, as you kind of continue and learn more about manufacturing, you learn more about distribution, you learn more about clients, you, what I learned was I really wanted to make sure that I can be a resource for everyone. Um, if they wanted a generic real estate broker, I could be that person. But I wanted to be able to, to help them do multiple things. Number one, in my opinion, is planning the move, understanding the cost and the hurdles before you even spend anyone's time and go take a look at any new real estate. Talking about machines that Machine weigh tons exactly. and everything. Right. So what you want to do is you want to quantify the move costs. Mm -hmm. Quanti quantify the hurdles to move. Because once you do that, then you understand what it's going to take to move into a building, what the costs are, and why this building is better than this building because of the cost reduction of the amenities in this building versus this building. You can also offset costs if a manufacturer wants to lease by having the landlord pick up some of the costs from your move or set up the building the way you want it so it's not coming directly out of the manufacturer's pocket. So you can try to remove, or not remove, but more reduce the move costs. And then obviously when you're looking to move on the buy side, there's creative financing ways that obviously you know those professionals can help a manufacturer with. So quantifying what you need, um, how much is going to cost, and how are you going to get from point A to point B by bringing in other resources such as a machinery mover, a mover, electrical contractor, an operational consultant. Um, those types of people, by bringing them to the table, make the chances of a successful real estate move. Um, you know, obviously, it's a, greater, it's a greater success rate.